Hello, I am Mary Frances Allen from the Veterinary Channel. Today, we will discuss using a new tool to treat mammary tumors in dogs. The product we will discuss is immunocidin, which is based on mycobacterium cell wall fraction technology. Mycobacterium species are profound stimulants of the immune system. In addition, studies with other microorganisms have shown an ability to stimulate the patient's immune system, leading to the inhibition of tumor growth. Immunocidin anti-tumor immunotherapeutic characteristics come from the non-pathogenic mycobacterium flay, which has been shown to trigger a rapid and broad response by stimulating innate and adaptive immunity through the production of neutrophils, macrophages, and lymphocytes, which enable tumor suppression and reduces tumor growth. In addition, it has been demonstrated that mycobacterium flay inhibits the proliferation of tumor cells by inducing apoptosis. The source organism used in this product is a non-pathogenic saprophytic mycobacterium, which is grown, extracted, and formulated, and has been proven safe and efficacious to treat tumors and bacterial and viral infections in various species of animals by multiple routes of administration. Two studies were conducted to assess the safety of intravenous administration of immunocidin in healthy dogs. In these studies, there were no clinically significant adverse events observed. In addition, no macroscopic or microscopic changes were observed in the lungs, liver, spleen, or bone marrow of the dogs participating in the study. In a study with six dogs diagnosed with malignant mammary tumors, five of the six went into remission following treatment with immunocidin. In another study with six dogs diagnosed with mixed mammary tumors, five of the six dogs went into remission after treatment. Immunocidin stimulates the immune system of dogs suffering from mammary tumors. Following injection directly into the tumor, Immunocidin is highly effective as a standalone treatment of mixed mammary tumors and adenocarcinoma in dogs. Although immunocidin is administered by intramural injection, the response is generalized and untreated sites undergo regression. The use of immunocidin offers the following advantages. A high tumor-free survival rate, an injection that is well tolerated by dogs of all ages, including those with chronic illness. This product induces apoptosis of tumor cells. Immunocidin is a treatment option for dogs that may be at risk for surgery. Immunocidin is a choice that minimizes the side effects associated with chemotherapeutic treatments. Immunocidin has an excellent safety profile. This product is an alternative that poses no health threats to hospital staff. Immunocidin can be used as a sole treatment via intratumoral infusion. The veterinarian can use it before scheduled surgery to facilitate the removal of tumors. After the surgical procedure, the veterinarian can also use it to treat neoplastic tissue that the surgeon could not remove. Immunocidin can be used in conjunction with chemotherapy. The dosage of immunocidin varies with tumor size. The average dose is 2.5 milliliters per tumor, but can range from 1 milliliter to 10 milliliters. The treatment should be repeated every one to three weeks until the tumors are resolved. The average cumulative dose of this product is about 7.5 milliliters to 10 milliliters. It takes three to four treatments to achieve tumor remission. Please remember to visit our subscription webpage at veterinarychannel.tv for more videos. In addition, your monthly subscription is used to pay the tuition costs of veterinary students in underdeveloped countries.